Hi, this is Fred Gagné from Hewlett Packard Enterprise and today I'd like to showcase how to manage HP Nimble Storage DHCI using our vCentry plugin. But first let's do an overview of what HP Nimble Storage DHCI is. Nimble Storage DHCI is a disaggregated hyperconverged platform that delivers the simplicity of HCI with the flexibility of converged. This new platform integrates hyperconverged control with the world's best-selling server HP ProLion and the self-managing experience of HP Nimble Storage to uniquely give enterprise effortless management and self-service with the performance, resiliency and efficiency needed for business critical apps. It's simple to deploy and manage with native full stack intelligence from storage to VMs and policy-based automation for virtualized environments. It's ready for business critical apps with absolute resiliency with over six nines of measured data availability and some millisecond of low latency at consistent high performance. And finally, it's built for efficient scale with the ability to independently scale compute and storage non-disruptively with industry leading data efficiency guarantee. That's enough with the high level marketing pitch. Let's go over the demo. So first I click on HP Nimble Storage and then I select the Nimble Groups. So here you have the home dashboard. On top you can see the performance of your Nimble array from a latency, IOPS or megabyte per second perspective. You have the snapshot protection in place for your VMFS and your Vival VMs. You can see the usage of your environment from a virtualization and a storage perspective. If I go over the capacity saving, I can see all the data reduction mechanism that we have in place, such as the duplication and compression. Under system, you can find the wellness or the health of your environment from the virtualization, compute or physical server and storage perspective. Here you have all the alarms and recent events coming from the Nimble Array. Under Data Store, you have VMFS and Vivol. Under VMFS, you can create, edit, grow, delete, snapshot, clone, and mount VMFS Data Store. Under Vivol, you can create, edit, grow, and delete. Vival Data Store. Under Vival VMs, you have local, replicated, and deleted. From this tab, you can manage your Vival VMs across local, replicated, and deleted VMs. Under Inventory, you have two options server and storage. Under server, you can see the host status of your ESXi host. You can see the ESXi management IP addresses, ILO IP address, and you can also find the server health. If I go over OK, I can see the server health of the server that I have in my environment. You can expand cluster to add any newly ProLion server in your environment. You can remove server and you can also update password of each ESXi host that you have in your environment. Under storage, you can see the group name, the software version that you use. You can see the pool, all the usage of your Nimble array again, the saving, you can see the array, the serial number, the configuration, the usable capacity available, and the health as well. You can see the replication partner that you have in your environment. Under events, you can see all the log and alarms of the Nimble Array. You can also acknowledge, unacknowledge, change reminder and delete any, any alarms from the Nimble Array. The last tab that we have is the configuration check. Here, we have defined 54 rules that we check every 24 hours to make sure that your environment use the correct configuration. As you can see here, I have two violations. Under detail, we explain or we provide you why you have a violation in your environment. In this one, 
the vSphereHA is not enabled on the cluster. Then I would have to enable vSphereHA to get to remove this error. If for some reason you do any modification in your environment, you can rerun the checks by yourself by hitting rerun check. Thank you for watching. If you want to learn more about HP Nimble Storage DHEI, go to hp.com storage slash DHEI.